Damn, guys, look at this, man. Look at all the corpses. The guy's hand is opening and closing, and that guy's leg is twitching. Whoa. <laughs> What a beautiful morning. What's up, my immune friends? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Miss Survival. I've just been sleeping up here on the wall all night. Um, we're going to go hit some bandits today, okay? I'm going to have some breakfast. We're going to have we're gonna have a little chat, and I'm going to go hit some bandits. There's one thing that I did not get on this update that I kind of forgot about a little bit, um, and that is the hunting rifle, all right? So people have been telling me the hunting rifle is dropping off of bandits. So I think we're gonna go. We're gonna go hit up at least one bandit base. If we do it quick enough, um, we'll hit two. Um, I'd really like to. Uh, I'd really like to get that hunting rifle. I'd also like to maybe find Scott. A lot of people have been asking me, "Okay, oh, get Scott, get Scott." You know, Scott, Scott, Scott. And I've tried to get Scott. I've hit all three bandit bases. The bandit base where Scott was was actually. It was actually. Um, it gave me Kate. It gave me a second Kate. Oh, by the way, this is a little thing here. Whenever I log in. There's like no furniture anywhere, but if I leave the area and come back, there'll be furniture. Maybe it takes a little while to log in. I'm not uh, to zone in. I'm not really sure. So let's come over here, and then let's go back over here and let's see if the furniture's. Yep, yeah, there it just popped in. Okay, so yeah, the furniture's acting a little weird. Yeah, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Early access game. We've been having updates. It's it's bound to be that way sometimes. Um, so uh, there's actually been a couple updates since last time I played, and I wanted to show you something that is freaking awesome. So check this out. The repair pinch does work. All right. That is awesome. But the stuff's a little expensive. This actually isn't that expensive. When I put my bow in there, like I had a bow that was like 23%. And when I put my bow in there, it wanted some ridiculous amount of stuff. Right. So, oh, you know what? Since I'm going there, do we have any? Yep. All right. Let's grab some of this. I don't have any helmets with me, which is a which is a bummer, but that's okay. Oh, I already. Never mind. I was looking at the wrong thing. I actually need. I only need the helmet. <laughs> All right, whatever. Let's get going, guys. So the um the repair bench is now repairing stuff. It doesn't repair uh, car stuff yet, or so I've been told. I haven't actually checked. I'm ninety percent sure it doesn't repair car stuff, but just for the sake of being thorough. Because um, let's face it, guys. The repair bench. The main thing we want off the repair bench is the ability to repair car items. I mean. Like the tools and stuff, like like I said, I put I put that bow in there, and it wanted like a ridiculous amount of resources to um to make the bow like to repair the bow took like eight string or something like it was just insane. Um, so oh boy, I'm gonna tear that down. By the way, I'm gonna tear it down. I the wall right there that has the ladder, I could replace it with a wall without a ladder, and I'm going to because it's uh it's messed up. Yeah, see, so you can't repair that kind of stuff. What is a hammer? Yeah, it's a lot to repair for a hammer. I'm pretty sure I can make one for cheaper than that. But, I don't know. Balance, you know. Balance will get there. That's not what we're worried about today. What we're worried about today is we're going to go kill us some bandits. All right, guys. So, let me get let me get out to the bandit base. And then, uh, we're going to see what we can do. I'd like to hit two bandit bases today, if not three. You know, we'll see how fast things go. Um, I've got 16 bandages. I'm not sure if I'm missing anything else. I don't really know. I've got food and water in here. I've got some backup bows, arrows. You know, the whole nine yards. So, let's get going. Oh, yeah, guys. Another thing about the uh, update. Basically, it was like a, a hot fix. He fixed a bunch of stuff. Um, it said, can't destroy objects with axe. Now, I tried. I still can't destroy the cars with the axe. So, some of you guys are telling me in the comments. Um, can I get confirmation from more people? Uh, I was told that the sledgehammer... You could use the sledgehammer to um, break cars. Is that true? If that's true, that's actually pretty cool. That's that's progression. If, if you could really do that... That is really awesome because progression is something I really enjoy, and that is really nice progression because the um, the sledgehammer is expensive. So if that's what you need it for, wait, why don't I have any arrows? This thing isn't full. Oh, okay, my bad. There we go. All right, so let's see if we can take out some bandits. I should have plenty of arrows. So I did build a um a little like wall over there. And I could use that wall to easily take out these guys, but I'm going to do it from over here this time. We'll see. We'll see how things go. Let's go ahead and save the game just in case stuff goes bad. We need to get close enough so they spawn in. I can't tell when they spawn in. Oh, there they go. All right, guys. Turn that off. Come on. Come out the door.
Oh, they just despawned, didn't they? Yeah, you can't get too far away. So I don't know how that hunting rifle is going to work. I mean, if you, <laughs> you can't get too far away, they, they despawn. So, come on, guys, spawn. There we go. All right, I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna duck because I want to be able to move quickly. Oh, did he? Did they despawn again? Damn, dude. All right. Well, I guess I'll just stay right here. Come on. Come on, boys. Come to the opening. Not sure which way I'm missing. Oh, looks like he fell short, didn't it? Oh, okay. So yeah, the arrow drop. Let's see if we can get that guy. I think I just hit him. Come on. Got him. Yeah, these guys are broken, dude. They're not even moving. They don't know whether to shit or go blind. Oh boy. Oh boy. Damn! I was just about to say they're going to despawn, aren't they? So will all of them spawn back in or just a few? I don't think they all spawn back in. Maybe they did. Alright. Okay, they're not despawning. Man, these guys are blind. Okay, don't despawn. Don't despawn! Yeah, when they despawn, they all spawn back in. Okay. So let's, let's take the arrows out of here. And go to equipment, put them in here. little high. Oh boy. Punk ass. Okay. There they are. Alright, let's go ahead and heal. Status. That feels like a... Yeah, just wounded. It's not severely wounded. Usually when I get shot, I'm severely wounded. Oh, man. Still more? All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. No. 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 Got him. Got him again. Okay, we got four arrows left and one guy. I wonder if, you know, I could probably farm these guys if I keep backing up and they keep respawning. I'm gonna have to go in for this guy, aren't I? Oh, maybe not. There we go. Alrighty. Get my arrows back. Oh, good, they're dropping food. That is very, very handy. This guy's got an arrow on his back. This guy's got some broccoli. Uh, snack bar. A protein bar. Or... No, it's chocolate bar. Oh, that's... Oh! Man, I'm dying. Man, I must have killed like eight guys at least. I'm thinking ten. <laughs> uh, I got to try not to back up, I guess. It's just so hard not to, you know. It's like instinct. You know, they're coming at you. You're just kind of backing up. All right, let's see what we can do here. One down. Okay. 
Hopefully they'll be like, hey, where did uh, Peter go? You know, the guy who was guarding the door. Oh, really? Oh, that was a good shot. Man, they are coming out in force now. See, that's the problem. When they come out in force, I can't back up. What? Oh, I was going to say. Yeah, because when they come out in force, like, if I'm facing, like, three guys at once, I can't back up because they'll just respawn. So that really puts me in a bad spot. They just respawned again. All right, I tried, like, three more times. I, I simply can't take them like that because if I back up, uh, they'll respawn. And if I don't back up, they, they, like, rush out of there, like, three at a time, and I can't take three guys at once. So I'm just going to come up here to my little uh, tower thing, and we'll see what we can do from up here. Okay. All right, so let's see what we got in here. Did they spawn? I don't even see them. Yeah, they did. Yeah, see, they come right out. Like, yeah. Okay. And we're going to leave him alone. Let's take this guy out. Ugh, come on. I knew I was waiting too long. All right, guys. Look at where are they going? <laughs> Man, they're walking right past where I was. Well, kind of. I was kind of more over there, but... That dot really screws me up. I keep trying to point at where the dot is. There we go. Okay, are they going to try and come up here? This is going to be the same same time as last time. Uh, I don't know. I don't know where they went. I have no idea where they went. Alright, let's get out the old bow then. Alright, come on, dude. Oh, I can't hit him there. Come on. Yeah, they go outside, man. That's rough. And I don't know where those other two guys went. They, like, walked off or something. Can't really see that well. Oh, that was right... They hit him right in the head. <laughs> I, t I think I pierced his ear. Is he going to come up here? Yeah, he is. Wow, they can actually come up here and fight you, it seems. Because he looked like he could get up here and fight me. Man, he's definitely working on the AI. <laughs> because last time they couldn't even walk up this thing. Alright, is that it? I don't see anybody else. That doesn't mean there isn't anybody else. It just means I don't see anybody else. Okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing anybody. Can we go this way? You think we're going to break our leg? Yeah. Better not try. Oh, dude, he's got a arrow through his thumb. All right, we got to make sure we stay in this area because if we don't, they're definitely going to respawn. And let's look around for that gun, too. The rifle. That's really what I'm here for. They probably don't drop it, uh, like, on their bodies. They probably drop it on the ground. Okay. Guess we're not going to have to fight those guys that walked off. They're gone. Hello? Any bandits? Any more bandits? Not seeing any. Let's grab all their stuff. Everything in the city respawned, by the way, guys. At least I, I saw stuff respawning. Oh, maybe you can take out the cars. Okay, the car I must have tried in the city couldn't be taken out, so... I just assumed you couldn't take out the cars anymore, so I guess you don't need a sledgehammer for it. So I'm not really sure what the sledgehammer's for. Okay, any of this stuff respawned? Nope. Didn't think so. Alright, let's go up there and see if we got Scott. I'd really like to get Scott. 
I know I made jokes about Cockblock Scott, but you know, now I'd like to find him. Hello? Nope, didn't think so. Uh, how's our body armor? Eh, it's okay. Take another one. We don't need any pills. And we already looted all that. Okay, well, no hunting rifle, which is really what I wanted. Well, this is funny, guys. I was going to just uh, go drive off and try another bandit camp, but I forgot. If you walk away and come back, they all respawn. So, to hell with it. Let's just, uh, let's have them respawn. All right, that should be close enough. I'm hoping one will come out of that door right there. See, they come out in force. That's rough. I'm going to let those guys walk away. But the thing is, if I go too far back, they're going to despawn. And then they're going to respawn. And then anyone I killed won't count. So it looks like it looks like right away the first thing that happens when these guys spawn is two guys get out and start walking down that road. And I think what we need to do is we need to let them go. I think that's the way to do it. It looks like they're going on a patrol mission, maybe a loot mission. I like to think that they're going to the city um, to loot the city. It's actually pretty immersive now that I think about it. At first I was like, where are they going? That doesn't make any sense. But no, that's um that's hella immersive. So we're going to let them leave, and we're going to blast the rest. Hopefully they don't come around and come back. That was a headshot, man. Yep, now I backed up, and now they're all going to respawn. All right, guys, so with that being the case, we're just going to go right back up to our wall. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't know. Like, I feel like I haven't, I haven't attacked the bandits in a long time. Have you guys noticed, like, a change in the bandit behavior? Like, they just, like, they know where you are and they run right at you. Which is, hey, man, it's realistic. But it's very difficult when you're fighting five on one, <laughs> you know? So, yeah, I mean, so we're just going to let those guys walk out that way. Uh, why am I still? There we go. We're just going to let those guys walk out that way. And we're going to just wait with our bow. Don't you know? All right, you two go to the city. All right, your Bravo team, you go to the city. You're going to... This guy's going to defend the outside of the wall. He's going to try to. Okay, and he's going to climb right up here. He's going to try and climb right up here. There he goes. All right. So what about you? I'm glad I built this wall, man. <laughs> it's pretty nasty. Oh, that guy. That other guy I hit in the head died. And, like, it seems like random when they die when you get hit in the, when they get hit in the head. Okay, you. Oh. Yeah, I keeps shooting over his head. Okay. He's going to come up. So we're going to get the shotgun ready. <laughs> yeah! Okay, and there should be at least one guy left. I saw another guy run back in. I just don't know where he... Oh, boy! Um, can you... Get... I could not take out my gun because he was right on me. So you know what I was thinking? You know how, like, sometimes when I get the headshot... They die and sometimes they don't. Maybe I should um, move up to the uh, better arrows because these are the basic arrows. So, kind of makes sense they wouldn't kill people that easily. Alright, so could we hit this guy? Nah, I didn't think so. That other guy go. Went through the blue entrance. Here we go. Okay, that was definitely a headshot. So you can see, like, I, you know what? I think we got to start using the hunting arrows. Coming up, bro. Coming up, come on up. I'm over here, bro. Where'd the other guy go? Oh, there, there's one of them. There's still another one in there somewhere. There he is. He's got a freaking arrow through his throat. Did you see that? The guy's got an arrow going through his throat. Alright, they're coming at me in force. 
Here we go. Next. <laughs> that shotgun blast to the side of the head is brutal. I really enjoy it. I know they don't, but I do. Alright, let's check to make sure there's no one down there. Nope. Alright. And we should have one guy left somewhere. I don't know where this little prick went. Definitely have one more. Oh, wow. Dude. Dude! Where's he going? Oh. What the hell is he doing? Okay. And I think that's the last one. Woo! Oh! There it is! There it is, boys. Now, we don't have um, ammo for it. But still, that's pretty sweet. Oh, look at that. See, how are we supposed to shoot from so far away? Because, like, <laughs> you can't get that... Guys, can you get far like far enough away from the bandits to use this to make it worth it? Because, like, if I get this far away, the bandits are not going to spawn. They're going to be despawned. So, we're going to need to make some ammo for it as well. Okay. All right, looking good. We did kill a guy in here, right? I thought. I got so excited by getting that. For, oh, there he is. Oh, we dropped some ammo. Cool. Not the ammo we need, but... I think next episode, what we're going to do is we are going to... We're going to go to the... What we're going to do is we're going to make a, a furnace by the... By the by the mine. You guys are telling me you make fur you make uh, furnaces by the mine. I think that's a really good idea. We're gonna make a furnace by the mine, and then it, and then after that, um, I'm just gonna like I'm gonna farm the mine like crazy. I'm gonna get a bunch of iron, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just cook it outside the mine. Then I'm gonna go because the ingots like take up a lot less space than the ores, right? So it makes a lot of sense. Really good idea, guys. I'm definitely going to do it. And then I'm going to go home. We're going to make the sledgehammer. We're going to see what that's for. I'm gonna people say it's for the car. Maybe it takes apart the car faster. That's the only thing I can think of. No, take the arrow. Dude, he had an arrow in his throat. I don't care how weak the arrow is. If you have an arrow in your throat, you should be dead. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. All right, well, while they're running out there, let's uh, go ahead and turn off the timer. Let's add arrows to this thing. Oh, God. Okay. I don't know why he did that. Oh, they're coming back now. They weren't far enough away. I don't think anybody else knows I'm up here, though. Oh, another one. Cool. Maybe I can dual wheel them. Where the hell are you going? Ugh, the collision just kills me. All right, let's just wait. Let's wait. Be patient. All right, I don't know what this jackass is doing. Hello. Okay, <laughs> just to line it up the bodies here. <laughs> Okay. Anybody else? Anybody else want a little? Let's grab that. We looted him. We looted him. Ooh, gunpowder. They didn't drop a lot of gunpowder. I think we're going to have to farm the mist for gunpowder. Oh my god, look at them all down there. Alright, let's get down there. Shotgun... Okay, that's a big-ass shotgun. Alright. Take those carrots, please. Alright. And what about you? Alright, I'll take that food. Alright, guys. So, uh, alright, next video, we're going to go to the mine. We're going to make a furnace right outside the mine uh, because you guys had a, that awesome idea. And then I'm just going to cook up a bunch of iron. We're going to make the sledgehammer. We're going to see what that's good for. So, guys, uh, if you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.